hello guys uh, welcome to tech design in this video i will be explaining you about the solid modeling commands so in this video i'll be explaining only two commands that are very very important for solid modeling that are extrude and revolve in my previous uh, tutorials are all about the sketch uh, commands and sketcher commands and sketcher tutorial examples so please go back to my channel and check out the videos please subscribe to my channel for more regular updates on any graphics so uh, quickly we will move on to the sketcher environment for uh, extrude so I will draw a sample rough sketch for the um, extrude so 50 height and 50 width so I will draw one more uh, line under this so it will be easy for you me to explain each and every command in the extrude okay guys i'll just finish this sketch you can see here i draw a profile and uh, i just wanted to extrude this profile along a direction so go and here select an extrude or else for the shortcut you can use x in the keyboard so press extrude and you can see here there are a lot of options here inside okay so it is asking for the section or section curve so which curve you want to extrude so if you select this curve it will be automatically connected curves will be selected if you want to filter it you can filter it i will just explain this in, in the next so let it be as connected curve you can see here it will be extended if you click ok it will be coming so if you want a distance of 100 or 120 you can give it and click ok this is a simple extrude so i will just explain you each and everything inside the sketcher ok here we go guys suppose you have you don't have that extrude now the sketch is like this and you want to make the L shape, I will select it now, then you will be able to get it. L shape of extrude. So, for that, what you have to do is make sure that single curve is selected and stop at intersection is selected. So, what it will do, even though the curve is very long, it will stop the selection at the intersection. So, I will show you how it is. This curve, wait a minute, okay this curve i will select you can see that the curve is still the end but it is selected until the intersection this is what it happens when you select the stop at intersection you can see that you can see that oh my god so this is how you can you make a use of this filter make sure that stop at intersection is selected so that a very a small portion of a sketch you can able to use it for extrude this is very very useful guys so this is about the portion of sketch to be extruded and here in the next we will have a directions direction you can give the direction you can change the direction if you want so i will keep it as it is here in the limits under the limits there is a start limit and end limit the start limit you can give a value and uh, symmetric values value is nothing but just giving a value if you want you can give the start point suppose there is, this is our plane on which the x sketch is existing if you want the extrude to be start from some distance you can give the start point as 28 or 30 it will start from that point so this is very useful guys so if you want you can give a negative value which will take you to the other direction okay so the next is symmetric value symmetric value will create uh, the equal amount of extrude on the other direction suppose if, if you give a 50 mm so in each direction it will be 50 in the opposite direction it is 50 and this side it is 50 so it will totally it will become 100 mm the next is value i'll go to value and until selected i will just explain the until selected until extent is till the 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 face appears okay so for that reason i just want to one more body here so i will just go ahead and create one uh, <clears throat> arc okay 
this is uh, my arc and uh, create one more line over here so it will be clear for you to how you can use the extrude in different different uh, situations so we'll just uh, extrude these two with a symmetric value of uh, 50 is enough i think okay yeah here we go guys extrude so i'll come back to the same extrude again you need to select the curve which you want to extrude so i will select this curve so it will be selected a, a cube okay uh, yeah mm, now the value is there you can give the end point until the next so it will extend until the next body or any face exists you can see here until this face it will be extended it will take the profile how the next body is so is that guys okay and the next is until selected you need to select the face or any body until which you want this curve to be extruded i will select this face you can see that it goes beyond this face and it is extruded up to the face which we have selected suppose for example the more interesting thing is i'll just give this value okay i'll remove this okay, let it be 20 here the sketch is lying on this plane i want the extrude to be happened from this face to this face okay guys i will give my start point until selected from this point it should start and where is the end point end point is this point click ok can you see this guys it's very interesting you can see here our sketch is lying here but extrude is started from this plane sorry this face up to this face okay here we go and this is all about the limits guys this you can use in uh, various uh, situations in different different way and uh, i will just move on to booleans i will explain it to you later so we will go to draft so before that i will just make it as a symmetric value with the uh, hundred okay yeah mm, inside this i will just hide this uh, this is not more required now I'll just hide these two okay inside uh, extrude what we have to do a draft you want to give a draft draft what is the draft draft is nothing but a it's a kind of relief that is given to a body in order to remove it from a core or core or a drag so here the draft will be there from a start limit you can give this is our start limit so it will be taken from this face from this space face it will be x you can see here guys from this it will be started going to a draft you can give any angle here or else you can give angle here and the next is from section you need to select a section from where you want to start it so from this section it is st starting because the section is over there so this is all about the draft guys this is these uh, symmetric and asymmetric are same as what we have discussed in the uh, fillet and chamfer the next is offset so offset is single sided whether the uh, i will just switch off the draft so that it will be confusion for us okay now single sided offset you can see here our sketch is up to here but 5 mm it is offset it if you give 10 mm it will increase if you give 15 mm it will increase so it will be offset on on the single side so if you want make to make it two sided you can see that hollow will be created so start point and end point you can give from 10 to 15 you can see here it will be created in the settings only two options are there either you want a sheet or a solid if you give a sheet it will come as a sheet and if you give it a solid it will become a solid so this is about the 
sketcher i just wanted to explain your boolean operations again once again uh, this is a left out thing now in the preview there will be a preview it will show otherwise you can switch it off and directly click ok to see how it looks so now we will go to boolean options so what we, for the boolean option options i need uh, one more body i just create it uh, one more body here on this sketch i'll take a circle and i will draw a circle here and i will make sure that it, it will be extruded you can see guys extrude how you can use the until next how you can use here select this curve and till what i need until the next sorry not until the next until selected so until this i need and make sure that none is selected and click ok ok what has happened until selected ok i will just uh, make a give value here and click ok you can see here this is one body and this is one body so you want to make it unite you want to make single body then the boolean operation comes into picture you can always create a boolean operation separately by here you can see here these are the boolean operations unite subtract and intersect or else you can make it in the inside the extrude itself here is the extrude so if you want to make a unite with this body it will automatically take the body if you don't want this you can always deselect with a shift and you can select the other body if it is there available so you can subtract this and you can intersect this so uh, boolean operations i will uh, make a separate video for this this is also a very important uh, uh, things um, i will make a separate video for this please uh, go and check my um, channel so that you will get to know so this is all about the extrude guys so i will make it none and click ok if you want you can make a unit here select one body and second body it will be united <coughs> so now i will just remove all everything and we will move on to we will move on to okay i'll just delete all these things okay yeah what is this okay this is okay let it be i'll just hide it next is revolve so revolve is almost as a filtration inside almost similar you can see the limits booleans and uh, offset you can almost similar but it it is a revolve okay it is asking for the curve which curve this curve okay make sure this single curve or connected curve is selected connected curve is selected now this it is selected axis along which axis you want to revolve I will give as this okay you can see that guys it is revolved so it is also same thing until selected if you have any intersection inter intersection point or intersection body until which you want to revolve it you can easily give similar to the previously which we have discussed and even this boolean operations as well as same as that of the previous so here also if you want to make a sketch to be different uh, you just wanted to select the l shape so make sure that single curve is selected and stop at intersection is selected and uh, go on selecting uh, these things so it will be okay okay guys so you can see that it will be revolved and uh, if you want a sheet you can change into settings go to sheet and select it make i will make it as a solid and see here it is it will be revolved so this is all about the revolve and uh, extrude guys please subscribe to my channel for regular uh, updates on all the commands so uh, in my tutorial i will be explaining about uh, um, solid modeling and uh, surface modeling sheet metal routing electrical routing and then drafting please subscribe to my channel so that you will get a complete knowledge on any graphics thanks thank you thank you one and all